So if you're experiencing tension in the back of your neck or getting tension headaches, you might try this little peanut and putting it under your neck as kind of a cradle. And you can either do it just without rolling it, or I kind of like the rolled up towel around the peanut just to keep it in place a little bit better. You're just going to put it across kind of the base of your skull there, and then gently lie back and just set your head on the peanut and just rest for several minutes. You can also roll it back a little bit, just find a nice comfortable spot. You can gently just lift your nose a little bit, kind of rolling the peanut underneath your neck and back of your head. You can turn a little bit, kind of make some circles, roll a little bit from side to side across the peanut, just to release any muscular tension in that neck. And then just play around with, you know, moving the neck, or moving the peanut a little bit further down the neck and seeing what's comfortable. You might find it easier to work it from side to side when it's a little bit lower down on your neck. So there's not a lot of right and wrong. You're not going to hurt yourself doing it, but find where it's good for you. Where do you have the tension? And that's where you're going to put that peanut and work the most on it. Then, after you have released those muscles with the peanut, you can sit and just apply a little bit of side bending motion. Your arm is going to reach out to the side from your hip, and then just gently press on your head with the other hand. You can move your hand to the back of the head and draw it down to look at your knee. So if we're bending our head to the left, we're going to look at the right knee. Then you'll bring your head back to the sideways motion and come back up to center. And then of course we'll repeat that on the other side. So draw your head to the side gently. This arm is going to reach out to make the length here. And then you'll move your, head to the, uh, your hand to the back of your head. Draw your chin down to look at the other knee. And again, we're getting the side of our neck and the back of the stretch. And then return it to the side and then come back to center. Oh, my neck feels longer already.